Hi, Cancerians. Thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Astro Girl. And what a week we have for you this week. It's actually a very good week with Venus, the goddess of love, moving into Pisces, your fellow water sign, and your ninth house of spirituality and being open to learning new things. It's a great time for you to meditate, to go to yoga, to really put yourself into a meditative, relaxed state. Okay, remembering that Mercury, the planet of communication and clear thinking, continues his retrograde journey and this week gets into a bit of a battle royale with the sun on Friday. Now this is an inferior Mercury retrograde, meaning that we have Mercury moving closer to the Earth than even the Sun, setting off all of those uh, magnetic problems which can cause you to lose keys, drop keys down the elevator shaft or in the, the gutter, you know, anything like a magnetic kind of thing. Lock your keys in your car, you know, um, lock yourself out of your home or set off alarms or you know run out of petrol or gas even though it says you've got quarter of a tank all sorts of crazy things can happen when venus is out of phase and it's at when sorry when mercury is out of phase and it's out of phase in aquarius so it's going to be affecting the social airways as well so it's a really good idea not to put anything on facebook that you will regret remembering words with re are what you should be focusing on while Mercury is retrograde, reviewing, redoing, rescheduling, reinventing, re-mashing, all those sorts of things. Now Venus, the goddess of love, moves into Pisces where she is happiest and it's a wonderful time for you to soak some of that wonderful loving energy up. Soak it up like a sponge. If you know anyone born under the sign of Pisces, they're the perfect person for you to hang out with, to get some inspiration from, for you to do some meditation or yoga or go on a nice long hike with, for you to fall in love with. Remembering with Mercury retrograde through February 11, that love connection may not click until around Valentine's Day, but how perfect is that? Have a great week, Cancerians, and I'll speak to you again next week.